This is Buffy Leanne. I am a researcher and a scholar, and I bring you the experience. They're still hid. They're, they're still hid. They're everywhere. Oh, yeah, you go down Sequoia Hills in the main boulevard, and there's Indian mounds in the, they didn't destroy them or anything, they just left them in the center meridian, whatever you want to call it, so you can see them there. You know? Most people just knock them down, and I don't know what they do with the people in her dad, and they would not all of them had anything in but um, they left them alone in some way, all of a sudden they're probably resuming which I think was a good idea because they were they were not to be messed with. And when I was in Mississippi, we went down to where the pyramids had been built by we don't know if they were built by Mexican people on their trade route, prehistoric Mexican people along their trade routes because they were along the way the Mississippi used to run before it. The version, the one small, where it's not small river, but you know what I'm saying. It was a lot bigger and it used to run anyway, um, differently. And I went up to those pyramids and uh, you could feel something there. There was something, there was a power there. I walked all the way up to them, they were real high up there. Have you ever been to the Greenback Castle? No. There's a Greenback Castle that's not far from the ancient Star Wars on Fort Mouth Lake. Oh, really? Yes. Some of it, it's not even enclosed. It looks, some of it looks like ruins. Some of it, he, the man that, that owns it, I said that he built it all. But you can tell a difference. Some of it is very well done, uh -huh. very good Masonic work, and then a lot of it is just sloppy slapped together. Yeah. So you know you can tell. Yeah. This that this could either be a remnant. Yeah. Of an ancient civilization. Yeah. He says that. Um, he says that NASA come in. Uh -huh. come in. Uh -huh. And I mean, it's been, it's been pretty much buried. Anything like the Melungeon yeah. people, anything that's been buried, there's something to be said about what's going on. Yeah. There. Yeah. Yeah. Completely. And I know you worked for Oak Lake Shore. Yeah. One time. Yeah, Eastern State. Eastern State. I'm pretty sure that that was built on ancient land. I think it was, and um, there are panels all under the ground there, and uh, stories that go with the panels about. Uh, one doctor I used to go to was, uh, he did his residency there, and uh, they found, they went back in the tunnel and they found a man dead with the uh, intake paper still on his belly. I mean, nobody had seen him since he had been admitted there. And then you have Veda Lewis who uh, got in a fight with another woman. She was a patient wife. And she got in a fight with another woman and uh, they put her, they didn't, they put them together in one of those rooms under the tunnels and they came back and they forgot to feed them. And they came back to feed them and they didn't have cracked open the little skull and was eating her brains. She was one of my patients and she was a friend. Oh, she was wow. really scary and crazy. And she was in her 60s. I, I did it with the old people. And she was in her 60s and the um, 30. And she was like a little or something. Real dark hair, big dark eyes. She was, 
she was dark skinned kind of. Uh, she was dangerous. We always had to watch Vader. Especially if she developed a, a kind of a crush on another woman that was in the unit. We had to really watch the damn because we didn't know whether she would snatch her up and beat her senseless or what she might do. What types of things did you see? Did you ever go in the tunnels? No, I never went in the tunnels. Um, we were we weren't really allowed to go in the tunnels. There was an entrance to the tunnels up on the hill where the original building stood, which was kind of a museum. I guess it's not there anymore, but um, there was an entrance to the tunnels there. I know there was an entrance to the tunnels there, but I had no idea where the other entrances are. How far down did you go? In Eastern State? In Eastern State. Yeah. Into the basement. I had to wrap up a dead person, and that was the one that was in the basement of Cliffside. Did you see anything? Oh, the place was really haunted. The place was really haunted. And then when I went back and worked for it, when it was Lakeshore, there was a lot of haunting and stuff going on there. We were working through the snow, and I went to the bedroom that nobody ever put anybody in. And I laid down on the bed and I went to sleep, and I noticed somebody was standing over me. And I thought John had come in the room to take a nap too, because they were going to my bed. And I said, John, your bed's over there. And I said that two or three times, and. Uh, I went back to sleep. Well, I asked him about it later, and he said he hadn't been in there. 